Hello and welcome to Compulsory Egress, a Thief 2 fan mission by Derek Bovin. Uh, his first mission, I believe. And uh, before we get started, let's read the briefing. It's not often I get such a good tip from idle gossip. For weeks I heard rumours that the rundown southern town of Novenbock was awash with fears of an imminent crisis. I didn't pay them much attention until the Trevian confirmed that an evacuation had been announced. Not an easy choice, considering they built a new city hall there just a few months ago, replete with garish decor and the regional treasury. Ha! Huh, what a move that was. Meant as some initiative to revitalize the area. Since then, the borough has been beset by a flood of trendy nobility trying to gobble up cheap urban real estate in a newly fashionable area. It's become a rat's nest of rich and poor. I overheard a family at the docks moaning that they were forced out of their hole in the wall for a few stacks of silver. Given its civic importance, the councilmen of Navenvolk have enlisted a mercenary force to defend the town once they clear out, under the command of the well-respected Captain Ricardo. I hear he's quite the hero, has the mind of a real strategist. Well, I guess that means they're expecting a siege. I'll have to find out more myself. The details have not been forthcoming. I'd better get going. Navenvolk has at least two days' travel, and I can't be the only rogue planning to make a killing from a town full of abandoned property. And in property, huh? Ah. Okay, you're camped out in an abandoned hovel near the south gate, but most buildings in the borough should also be vacant. Find out why Nevenvolk was evacuated. The new location of City Hall is supposedly furnished with gaudy trinkets, financed by a splendid treasury. Its vault is begging to be ransacked. Anything left behind can't mean that much to whoever owned it. Steal 4500 loot. Leave them murdered to thugs and blackguards. It's risky and unprofessional. Don't kill anyone. No point hanging around once you pick the place clean. Get back to the hovel and hightail at home. So if we go, like, uh, normal is 3,000. Hard 4,500, expert 6,000. Um, so normally my reason for picking hard is because it leaves me the option to kill people if I need to in a tight corner. Or if I just get really, really, really annoyed with any <laughs> it's a big old guard. Um, but this is this isn't, doesn't exist here. He doesn't. He's got no no kill objectives of any kind, and it just goes straight to don't kill anyone, not just not just don't kill civilians. Maybe there are no civilians. Um, I think I'll still stick with hard for the sake of more hit points and less loot to have to hunt for. Who knows? Maybe maybe there's not going to be much of a loot hunt anyway, and I'll easily amass. Six whole thousand. I mean, if we're robbing an entire district, six thousand sounds a lot, but it's pretty large numbers of, of gold here. Well, I'm sure it was like just no particularly bad reason the place was abandoned, right? It was just something like, uh, I don't know, a bit of flooding or something, surely. Let's start, make sure we have our supplies. We have two lockpicks, one loaf of bread, one compass. A couple of water arrows, one moss, three rope. Wait, is this my place or is this... No, that's... that's... beautifully low-tech. I like it. I like the audacity of just like, oh, well, it's not a fireplace. I won't even dig out the fireplace for the brush. We'll just throw an orange light and a crackling sound in front of it. That's great. Does this ladder go anywhere? Nope. Alright. Oh, someone's left us a message. Occupants of Navenvolk, the city council has decided that the compulsory egress will be enforced on the 13th day of Wanamart. Those of high class or wealthy estates will receive official escort ensuring their safe departure. Freeholders are advised to abandon their properties. A military detachment under Captain Ricardo will remain to defend the district. Those who refrain from emigrating, be they vagabond or commoner, may be conscripted to combat the crisis. Remain in the region at your peril. I like... I... I don't know for sure if this is... the Bergen's invention, but uh, I haven't encountered any of the other FMs I've played. He's got his own month names, which I saw in... Um, Ascended in Valley as well. Oh, look at this. 
big town square already. And we do have a map of the place. Oh right, we can see the entire the entire town, right? Oh no. <laughs> no 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 no. Uh go north. There's an entire other place here. Well, City Hall has a fancy map. Right, because we need to go to the City Hall, which is what we're planning to rob, right? To find the, uh, the treasury. Which is not marked on the City Hall map, but I guess it's there somewhere. Wow, okay, this place is huge. And uh, there's somebody asleep in the streets. Well, there was a statue here until somebody knocked it down. Ah, oh, there's a guy over here. Are you dead or asleep? Or neither? The door's been knocking? Somebody else sleeping up here. So even the guards they've left behind are not uh, not exactly at the top of their game. You all right there? You wouldn't notice your bottle going missing, will you? Hello, where's this go? What uh, M brings me to the notes page? Rather than... Uh, oh, no, this is sticking to the last page of mine. There's a hammerite uh, building, I guess. Seems they've done the uh, evacuation. Surprising, Amorites, you know, usually feel like they would be prepared enough to do things in an orderly fashion. Including, you know, I would have expected them to, like, pack up all their valuables and put them in a... Put them in a safe place, you know, a locked place somewhere. Obviously safe. Nothing safe when guys around. Oh, hello. I'll have to investigate that in a bit. And he's left the lights on even. I mean, look at that. It's ridiculously careless. That, no, it's just. The foot of the bed, okay. Well, what have we got? Valuable glasses, some notes. I was hoping we'd see some information about uh, why this place was in the state it was, but apparently not. I guess that door must be the stairs for this place. But it's been boarded up by somebody since. Maybe that's why the lights are left off. The place got boarded up. And they forgot to turn them off before, you know, they didn't have a chance to turn them off before they were boarded in. Sixth of one of the upper classes are becoming friends. Friend, 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 that's a word. Frenzied? 
They're looking to desert the borough, yet nobody can tell me what exactly they are so worried about. Their fears are nebulous and unspecific. I do not trust these men in high places. They incentivize the rich to buy property here. Now they insinuate some great threat that makes them want to leave again. Better to have left Nevenvolk alone. Yep. On the other hand... Music's in that little corner. So, I guess we're... No, we must be we're on the lower floor here. Right. <laughs> no, we're on the middle floor. Hello. Oh. Oh. <laughs> that was... That was not quite my plan. I don't have any health potions. Um... Well, luckily I didn't wake this, this fool. You have walked the first path to salvation. Here is the door. Nice. Well, you know what, what I'm gonna do? Let's stick a rope in there. To remind myself that that's where I was exploring. But let's see what's in, in the ground floor of the hemorrhage place. Oh. Okay, change of plan. Let's go back up. Seeing as the hemorrhoids need a key, and I don't have it. <sighs> I was trying to kind of just step over the edge to pick up plants. But, um... And while I was there, I had to try and... I don't know how I managed to... That thing went and leap right over the place. Oh, hello. Got guards. I don't know quite how I managed to fat finger it so badly, but I did. And I'm almost dead. So, uh... Great start, Garrett. Great start. Hello. Beard man. Uh, hoping for a uh, chance of uh, else, but apparently not. So there is a guard. In here. Fortunately, they were not here at the moment I made the jump. Which I couldn't really predict because I couldn't see the. Where is this? It's going north. Okay. Let's keep exploring this area first. Speaking of guards, I think I hear them coming. Did they stop or did they just. Step on carpet. Oh, they're going away again. Something strange about this roof, it looks very odd. Oh, hello. Nice, a transparent window there. Careful, Garrett. Now that opens, surely. Apples I can't pick up. This is terrible. I need hit points. Why do you give me apples I can't pick up? <laughs> is this a stove and sink adjacent to a Bath? What? How strange. <sighs> um, how's a bowl? 
It's these clanks I'm hearing. Oh, that safe has been looted. Oh, a cucumber. That's nice. So if that is a thing that opens... I guess not. Hello. I don't mind that water arrows are. Water crystals are kind of growing everywhere. Twenty-four thoughts to watch. That gormless rascal I've been trying to impugn the dignity of my fresh abode. Spent half the night rattling on about the grime and the stench in the neighborhood and my home. There was no revelation besides his ignorance of aesthetics. These furnishings are an apt hybrid of the current scene, a statement to the economic transitions of the borough. Also, my broker claimed. Oh, fire. It does smell awful. Is that... Did you think you'd make it smell less by, uh... <gasps> broken window. There's shards all over here. They could make it smell less by um, washing yourself in the same dish and the dishes at the same time. Oh, that doesn't open, but this does. Looks valuable. Okay, we have odd openable windows. Odd as in visually from a distance, there's really no way to tell it apart from an ordinary window. Bread! Bread! Give me hit points! Bad bread. <laughs> I mean, yeah, it's gonna be stale, right? It's been here for who knows how long. Oh, the money is not stale, though. Money is always fresh. No bread in the oven? Wow, okay. We'll go out to street level here, which is heading east. I don't really know where I am. I kind of lost track. Well, they took the letter away. So I'll have to improvise. There's a guard down there. What I'm going to do is I'm going to get back because we didn't finish exploring that first area I was in. This one. I hear the guards. Wait till it gets out of earshot, because I'll probably clatter when I land on that window ledge. Save just in case I fuck it up my previous one and fall to my, fall to my death. Hard one to fuck up. Railboat Baker, delivery entrance. Okay. Wait, this is a street?
Oh, hold on. I thought it was still above ground. How do you have to deliver it? Yeah, we are above ground. How do you have to deliver entrance on the first floor? I mean, I suppose there's little ramps, get carts along here. I don't know what the I don't know what it connects to. Maybe this whole part of town is. Um, on the side of a hill. What was that? Ah, uh, somebody stuck there. Let's uh quick save quick loads and try and free them. Unfortunately this gets coming back now. So we're heading... I feel like we're stuck in here, but that doesn't make sense. Green grocer baker, no, we're here. Okay. Uh, I want to go back. I want to go back. I want to finish exploring town square. So, okay, I'm waiting for this car to move on by. Just watch where you're putting that sword, man. Nearly, uh, sliced my nether regions off. Okay, so the question is how do I get down safely from here? I mean, I know how to get down, but safely? <laughs> That's not safely. Try that again. Flickering lamps, so, uh, What's there? Very distracting. Oh, he was shot. Alright, I don't think anybody heard that clang. Guess we can read the proclamations. Occupants of Navenvolk, uh, yeah, we've read that one. It's the same. Cool. Just making, making it so you can, you know, read it and get, read it in 3D by uh, using one eye for each. Right, we know this drunk guy. Okay, so, alright, let's make, let's start making some notes. Hammerites are... Well, the map doesn't really show this bit properly, does it? Maybe it does. Right, I guess we're here. So we need a key for that. We need a key for that. We need a key... The green grocers too. Everything is locked up really tight. Which I guess makes sense. Maybe maybe we won't be able to get into all these places, who knows. Uh, well this means the town square is still to the south, so I'm still too far north. Right. Town square. Somebody around. Not for sale. I don't care what offers or incentives you have. This home has been in our family since the first wall was built. I can hear somebody snoring, but I can't see any open windows. Well, this, there's a, a decahedron tower. That's quite unusual. There's definitely an open window at the top of that, isn't there? I'm not sure if it's open. It is a window. <laughs> oh, 
Wow, this is really new mental in the territory. I just got to another level. Nice goblet. I will gobble it. I mean, I will take it. Wonder is there a way that I can get up to that floor? Doesn't really look like it. Maybe from that side. That door doesn't open. And although enormous blocks of stone are falling off here, that's still too far to give me a, an access route. Let's go back down. <laughs> try climbing up the other side. Just very carefully now, Garrett. That's right. Well, what do we got here? Quiet. You didn't hear anything. Sitting what's long rear gatehouse. Fifth month, one month. Fifth day. Ingest of foreign peoples has decreased by 90% in 30 days. Reasonable to assume news of crisis has travelled beyond our borders. So far, commercial business and trade has only reduced about 5%. Thirteenth day. Barbican unit reassigned to escort duty for the household of Lord Martello. Guard duty to be fulfilled by a detachment under Captain Ricardo. I'll turn you up sooner or later. You heard not then. I guess it's all copies of the same notice that's isn't the spread all over town. Oh well. Could have come in the easy way. Pet peeve! Every FM I've been, you know, so many of them have little hatches with ladders to access them that go absolutely nowhere. I don't like it. To me, it, it's it's very weird. It's like, uh, why why put in weird, very unnecessary details? Like you wouldn't notice if there wasn't a hatch. Why put in a hatch that doesn't work? I I never understand the reasoning behind it. But, uh, I guess to some people, it makes sense to their to their understanding of of space or whatever of, of buildings. I mean, of, when I say of space, I mean of, of, you know, what a game space is and what it's supposed to communicate and how the player interacts with it. Can I climb this fine? I can. Alright, I have to be on the lookout in this map for more climbable vines because that's a thing that is random variation between one from one family to the next. Our vines climb the ball. <laughs> Alright, we've got... I mean, there's a door that's, not, that's just clearly just a texture. But it's boarded up. I mean, I guess in this case is doing the boarding up because it's part of the story. We don't know why the place was evacuated yet. Oh, that guy's got a light. <laughs> Oh, I'll take this though. Oh, no, it's not this guy, it's got a light. Where'd you come from? I know, but I'm clearly going to hell. So he's the guy that heard me, and that's why he saw me just then. Oh, he does have a light. Did he... Oh, I know what happened. Oh no, there's, there's two. I didn't get the uh, plates. So the one without the lights one that hurt me. Yeah, 
Temple Guard. <laughs> Watch your step. This place isn't as safe as you might imagine. Construction is very strange for a castle. Oh. Autumn. Guess it's nothing now. It is nothing. I'm half mantling up plants. Hello? Anyone there? <laughs> You're not getting stuck. Well, maybe it's nothing. Maybe there's no reason to be up there. Nobody! Come on, get out of here. Clumsy. Tap dancing. Oh, we heard that tiny footstep too. Just you wait till I find you. Who goes there? <laughs> hey, you're supposed to be unconscious now. Thank you. You can buy it, well, still no hit points. Yeah, okay, I have two more arrows, but still not really a good place to be uh, wasting them there, I think. Doesn't look like I can go higher. Oh god, they've heard me too. That's alright, I don't need to worry about that. You just keep keep imagining that you will. Oh. Great. <laughs> Come out here now. Where are you? I'm not kidding. Saw someone in here a bit ago. All right. I didn't actually look in here. I'm right place. Alright, recruitment center, it's up for 798, restoration finance for 836. Anyway, yeah, same same note. Oh I can go in there, okay. Does that mean means there's two hammer places? Or is this the same building that I was on the upper floor of? Give thanks to the Builder, but without him this lowly flesh would give no sustenance. Oh, fire arrow, nice. I mean... <laughs> okay, yeah, fair warning, it did look like it was supposed to be, uh... Not in good quality. I mean, it is meat and it had flies buzzing all over it, but... I was desperate, you know, but it didn't take away any hit points, or at least it doesn't appear to have done me any harm. I'm hearing some a voice from somewhere. I was a guard. What's out this way? Well, there is an upper floor as well. Right, east door. Is this the east door? Right, I've been there. So, we've got that key to sort it. So, how do we get to the upper floor? I mean, we could try this. I climb up an, on an inch. And clank with our feet. Rectory under private ownership. Oh, 
Okay, well, there was no reason to come up here. Very odd. <laughs> what I've got to do now is get down without dying and without waking that, that guard. Okay. Well, he's been, uh... <laughs> Very good timing there, mate. Very good timing. He's been hoarding some, uh... Goods for himself, so he he won't mind if I do the same, surely. But the Kalis, while thy report of approaching devastation may be taken as ill omen, I prefer to consider it a blessing. The record shows that the people of thy parish hath faltered in their belief. The scandalous departure of thy rector hardly helped matters. However, as the municipal government has submitted their injunction for our order to assist in this noble exodus, there will be ample opportunity to proselytize for the builder and his plan. Perhaps one might intimate that a crisis is an unsurprising reward for a faithless people. I trust thee to make the necessary arrangements. Master Forger Viotis. If the builder wills it, your prayers shall be answered. Oh, hello. See, and you, this is a good plan. Wow, the statue groans. Always chop down banners. Death to all banners. This... Why is this texture... Don't know, is that a difference in the stock settings between Thief 1 and 2? Because suddenly in Thief 1, this texture is a loud, clanky one, not a nice, quiet stone. It's like tile. It looks like tile. I mean, I'm not, not really complaining that it's not as noisy as I would normally expect. It's just a little bit surprising. Okay then. I think now I've seen all I can see in the town square and lost all the health that I'm willing to lose in the town square. I'm sure I missed something. But we can go explore here. Okay, so we need keys to the baker and the greengrocer. Now, I've been inside the baker, but I didn't. When inside the bakery. I didn't find, I don't think I found the other side of the delivery door, so there's at least one room. Hopefully a room packed floor to ceiling with bread. I can only hope. It won't be, it'll be flour sacks. Um, there should be at least one room I still have to loot. Ah, somebody's been here before us. Death to banners, though. Well, that banner is meaningless. Oh, they... They missed a valuable bottle, I guess, because it was in the darkness and they were in a hurry. Any valuables in the wine cellar? Hello? Just to get that in just one second. One more decent little coin. What does this do for us? For the love of God, Montreza. But that's a uh, beautiful cask of finest sherry back in this corner. Ah, that'll do. Anything upstairs here in the inn? 
way it's not upstairs in the end. This is the front door I came in by. Okay. So we got one guard there. Oops. And they're coming this way. I didn't even notice there was an open archway. I can't quite fit through that window. I was getting stuck when trying to mantle it. You don't need that money, sir. Something moved there. No. Okay, he's going there. That's what I want to see. Strange. I thought there was something there. Yeah, I mean, it did seem like it for a moment, didn't it? I guess it's the guard post. No, it's just, it's not a guard post, it's just somebody's front porch. <coughs> now the other guard's looking this way. And another guard is coming. Guys, what are you guarding the streets from? There's no, it's not like there's any thieves knocking about or anything. Only a fool would leave their home, and only a knave would break into mine. God, now this guy's gonna come back. Stand in the doorway in front of me. I mean, if I want to knock him out, it's gonna make it easy for me, but... You are, you are, you know, sir, with that message, you are courting. No, what the? Yeah, my thoughts exactly. Charge! I don't know how you managed to suddenly turn around and walk into me. Come out here now! No! I'm not kidding! You know what? Where'd he go? Let's. Get you out of the picture since, uh. Seems the most expedient thing to do. Well, hello, somebody left the coin in the box. Carrots! One hit point! Oh, hooray, you are my favourite carrot. Apple? Apple is not so good. Cucumber? Oh, oh look at that! Glory, glory, glorious four hit points. Wow. Uh, I didn't think I thought that letter tray was ornamental, I didn't think it would be actually valuable. Carrot's got a better eye than I do. This feels like a safe now. Oh, 
Only a knave would break into his, he says, but he clearly has a window there. Window lens. It feels like it's tempting me to try and break in. I wonder if this is made of wood. Well, it is, but ropes do but ropes do not attach to it. There are no stackable crates. Oh hello, there's a window. Oh I know that window, that's Spots Bakery. Been in there, so get on that sign and we might be able to make a jump across. You know what? If I can remember how to get there, it might be worth doing. Well, I do remember how to get there. Just don't fall to your death again, Gary. <laughs> It was not so fun the last time you were there. Have I been across there? I have not. You know what? Let's do that. Ugh, terrible wine. Ah, all the good stuff. Now, was it from in there or was it down the hallway? I got that, I can't remember. That was through here. What was it? Yes, here we are. All right. Oh, no. Weirdly kind of getting stuck in half in the window there, which is odd. So we want to be on this one. I think we want to jump to that side and from there to the window. It's probably not going to be. Get out here where I can see you. <laughs> I'll turn you up sooner or later. Well, let's hide from this uh, archer since we accidentally made noise. Looks like it's nothing. It is nothing. Oh. No, it's a diary. Nope, can't read it. Alright. Since this is actually a room that I can get into. Okay. Let's uh, check it out. Scattered books. Hello. to make noise for those people here. Uh, bad idea, Garrett. Lighting the lamp. Bad idea. Alright, the arch is gone. He says he's coming back. Alright, his footsteps are leaving. Well, that's not the way to do that. <laughs> Beef. A terrible first person platformer. <laughs> Accepted, lady. Call me a knave, will you?
I'll take that. Going back upstairs again yet? Doesn't sound like it. Bones. Do you wonder what she's been up to? She seems to be humming quite cheerfully for having a nice collection of body parts. So what's she going to do down here? Chill out by the fire. <laughs> yeah, there's the door, just boarded up and sandbagged. Okay, so she has a sword. But uh, it's not a valuable one. It also has a big boiler there, but that's no use. It's a long way down. And I can get down, I think. Odd. <laughs> Garrett, the enormous human poop. Sewers. Anything down here, I wonder. There is indeed. <gasps> wow, this place is falling to pieces. Like the city streets, I would assume was just been ransacked. Was I would have assumed was just ransacked by looters, but apparently, hello X marks the spot. Hmm. It's not actually at all, okay. That's awkward. Very awkward. Uh, I seem to have got myself kind of stuck. of places to explore in this sewer. What does the X mean? Another one? What has been going on here?
George, is that you? It's a beautiful portrait anyway, wonderful likeness. Uh, we have a map here, which I guess we don't need. We've already got a map. For the last time, I don't care how rare it's supposed to be. Nobody wants a bloody thing. Either you find someone to fob it off on, or it stays down here. You're lucky I don't dump it in the rough. Very rare painting indeed. I guess the styles is too modern for these for these brutes. Nobody likes the look of it. Hello? I'll take that. Slow ball potion and a flash bomb. Well, I could certainly have used both of those earlier. So, if we continue north, we're going to go back to this other section first because there's more of this sewer I had not explored, right? That's the way I came in. Garrett. Thank you. Another X. Wait, so I can go down or up or further west. Bones. Lots of lots of people seem to have collections of human bones around here. What has been going on? Is that are these bone collections just the ordinary business of the town, or is it relating somehow to what's been going on here? All right, I've been here before. I saw this hatch. I did not open it. Now I know where it goes to. Let's get down. The lower level of the sewers. Alright, let's dead end. Oh my god! <sighs> One, two, three, four, double health. You know what? That is the most amazing thing ever. Yeah, it's just a health potion, but it's the most amazing thing ever. And I think that's going to be an excellent place to end the episode because now I am fortified for more excellent full damage. Uh, so thanks very much for watching, and I'll see you here soon for the next episode.